right here at the University of California at Berkeley, yeah. I believe that in the year 2016, public colleges and universities should be tuition free and we should lower student debt. But all over the country, uh, including the University of Vermont, schools are scrambling and they're figuring out ways to bring in revenue. Uh, I look at it from a different point of view and that's what this campaign is about, is looking at things from a different approach. And I understand that the Chancellor has a problem. Uh, but the way I look at it is different. The way I look at it is to say that we are the richest country in the history of the world. We have seen a massive expanse in income and wealth inequality. We have seen a rapid rise in millionaires and billionaires. We have seen a situation where large multinational corporations in a given year pay not a nickel in federal taxes because they stashed their money in the Cayman Islands. And what I believe, and again, this is an idea that the vast majority of the American people agree with. Nothing radical about it. We live in a competitive global economy. We will not succeed unless we have the best educated workforce in the world. So our job is to encourage not only young people, but workers to get the education that they need. And the way you do that is by having tuition-free public colleges and universities. And that is an idea that is supported by people all across the spectrum who understand how important uh, education is to our country, and we pay for that. We pay for it through a tax on Wall Street speculation. That's what we do, you know? What the conventional wisdom is about is Wall Street's greed and illegal behavior destroyed the economy. Of course we're gonna bail them out. Why would we not bail them out? But young people who desperately need a good education, of course they should leave school fifty or seventy thousand dollars of debt. Why would we help them? They're not wealthy campaign contributors. That's the kind of thinking we have got to break through. All right, the needs of young people in this country and the future of our economy is as important as uh, uh, Wall Street. <laughs>